Dana was just up here and he said it's definitely going to be Colby for you next. Give us your thoughts on that. I don't know how that makes sense, you know. Um, yeah, the four, four, for over a year and a half, um, sat out, not injured. I just don't get how he just slides in for the, for the world title shot. When there's other guys in the division that's been active, been fighting, didn't sit out. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'm the king now. I've earned my way, you know, so I, I, I feel like I should decide um, who's next, you know. Um, so yeah. In front of you, right here. Uh, in terms of your game plan, obviously in the first, the second fight, uh, you said the altitude played a big factor, but it seemed like you were on, you, you were on your back against the fence quite a bit. You found yourself in that situation here, but you successfully defended the takedown. So, how much of this camp was just working on getting off the fence and keeping him off you against the fence? Um, I got a great, like I said, team behind me. Great wrestling coach, can be in um, <clears throat> that we drove. We drove. We know that once you get his arms locked. Is, is effective with his takedowns, and also the game plan was just not letting him lack his hands together to secure the single leg or double leg. Um, and I know once he did that, then the fight would be mine, you know? Colby, uh, after the fight, said that after he watched the first round, it said, he said, it seems like Usman coming out southpaw frustrated you, or you couldn't figure it out. How true is that? Um, <laughs> not true at all. You know, I, I feel I came orthodox. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, it is what it is. You didn't seem to throw many punches. It was very kick heavy. Was that the game plan coming in? Um, yeah, I was attacking his legs, attacking his body. To, I know he would have been worried about the kicks, right? Because what happened last fight. So I was trying to use my kicks to set up my hands, to bring his hands down, to be able to land, land the head kick. Um, but fair play to him and his team for working again, get a great game plan. Um, and him being disciplined all the way through the fight. Um, for me, not landing a clean, clean head kick, you know. Final one for me, uh, what did you make of the, the point deduction for the fence grab? Like, it seems like you didn't quite know what was happening until Turb Dean was like watching the replay. Um, I thought I should have got a warning at least, like a final, like this is a final warning, you know, but we just took the point straight away and, um, but yeah, here's what it is. Leon, what is your relationship with Kamari? Like you didn't touch gloves at the beginning of the fight, you guys are kind of talking to each other in between rounds, but there does also seem to be a lot of mutual respect. I'm curious what your attitude is towards him. Is there a beef or is it just like a competitive? Just competitive, you know. Like I said, I wish him well in whatever he chooses to do next. You know, there's, there was never no beef between me and Kamaru. I feel both just thought we, we was the bet, he was the better man, and that was it. You know, um, he heard his words after the, after the fight, and I feel the same way. You know, like I said, I wish him well. Um, the support is hard, um, so yeah, respect to him. He also said that you'll see him again. Do you think there's any world where you'll fight him again? Um, probably not. Probably not. It's been three fights now. You know, so um, I want to move forward in my career. Um, so yeah, I'll look, look towards um, more, more different fights. You know. In regards to Colby, you know, you said, oh, it doesn't make much sense because, you know, he's been out and he's, his record is like whatever. But for you as the champion that's getting paid view points, is he not the guy that's going to make you the most money? Um, if you're going pay-per-view wise, I'll probably go, if Masvidal beat Burns, that's, that's the fight to make. If you're going pay-per-view wise. Um, but I just don't see how Colby just sits out for a year, not injured, and then just sliding for a title shot. When I had to, I had to wear my 12 fights <laughs> to get there, you know. And um, when I was trying to get my title shot, they always like, like you're saying, who is he? And I don't know who he is. And now I'm the king. Now they're saying, oh, he's allowed to just jump the line and just jump straight in. But uh, like I said, I'm the king now. I'll decide um, who's next. So if Masvidal wins in Miami, for you, that's the one that makes most sense? Um, yeah, I just don't like him, you know, so I feel like that's the one I need to get back. I feel like there's a storyline there um, to tell. Um, so, yeah, if, if he gets the job done, I will, like I said, I'll have a look, I'll consider it, and I'll, if he begs me, then I'll, I might let him slide in, you know. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.